The Indiana National Guard received its second shipment of medical supplies today. Our Sarah Jones was there today on site this morning as NDOT and state police loaded up their vehicles and headed out to facilities now that are in need. Gloves, masks, gowns, and face shields. We have shipments coming weekly. This one was ordered by Indiana's Department of Health. From the strategic national stockpile, breaking that down and then loading those packages into Department of Transportation trucks and delivering them to the medical facilities, Departments of Health, hospitals. Where they go is based on predictive analytics of who will need what in the upcoming week. Well, there's some levels that the Department of Health is looking at, hospitals that may be in the black, a red, so looking at their image and then they are providing us with, hey, here's where you need to go. No one on site was authorized to speak for the State Department of Health. So we reached out to them via email to find out how many supplies in total, which hospitals, and how many were critical. But we still haven't heard back yet. The last shipment came in on Friday, and the next? By the end of this week. The National Guard said CDC guidelines were followed when supplies were sorted, but on site during the distribution process, we did not observe consistent social distancing. Supplies will soon be coming from multiple sources. The national security chains, donations, Indiana manufacturers, the Department of Corrections purchases that are being made by the state as well. The agencies involved said today's smooth operation demonstrates that we're all in this together. I